neutron stars are amongst the most powerful objects in our galaxy. They are so dense that they have a gravitational pull of such strength that if anything strays too close, it is dragged onto the star with extreme force. A neutron star is typically just a few miles across and will have a mass as great as the sun. So the densities are just enormous. Um, if you uh, dropped a, a marshmallow onto a neutron star, it would have the energy of an atomic bomb because the gravity is so powerful. Neutron stars seemed to contain enough energy to produce these gamma ray bursts. The only question was, what was actually triggering them? There were a number of ideas relating to neutron stars specifically. The idea was you drop something onto the neutron star and it releases a lot of energy. One idea was an asteroid uh, falling onto a neutron star. It soon became the accepted theory that neutron stars fired off these bursts of gamma rays if something collided with them. The mystery seemed to be solved. Now they had the answer, everyone began to speculate about the possible impact of these bursts on Earth. It began to dawn on them that if these explosions were coming from our own galaxy, in effect, they were occurring right next door to us. If a burst did go off in our own galaxy, uh, uh, it would be quite spectacular. It would be extremely bright anywhere in the galaxy. And if it were close enough, I suppose it could do uh, quite a bit of damage. Uh, some people have uh, hypothesized that uh, major extinctions uh, are the result of gamma ray bursts in our own galaxy. While they worked out that the odds of Earth being hit again were extremely remote, if it did happen, the effects would be devastating. Suddenly there would be a light in the sky, if it was 300 light years away, uh, a million times brighter than the sun. This would be the equivalent of one million megaton bombs going off all over the Earth at the same time. It would be Hiroshima all over the world. The atmosphere of the Earth would be heated. There would be gigantic hurricanes, cyclones, tidal waves, every form of destruction you can imagine. This may have happened to some civilization somewhere in our galaxy, probably did. But the likelihood that it will happen to us in the next million years is comfortably very small. 